Today I want to share a little video of a two-speed transmission I built for this little remote control micro crawler. Uh, I designed it and fabricated it with my 3D printer and I'll get into assembly. Alright, with this housing I'll have to feed the shift fork through there. It's kind of all, all goes in there kind of tight. But this goes in here like that. And then this. Kind of snaps in here. It's pretty tough stuff. I, I used PLA to print this. Um, hadn't really used PLA before. I was mainly using ABS. And uh, really impressed with it. It does melt at a lower temperature. Um, which is great for printing, gets you up and going faster between prints and whatnot. And uh, um, and it's a little bit more rigid. So for this, it worked out really well. All right, so you got the secondary gear in there, and then we'll throw a little grease on it. So when the shaft goes in there. It was a pretty fun project. Hmm. Okay. In the collar. Let's see if we can get that guy on there. All these parts I used out of here are from things I salvaged, just randomly uh, found broken. Um, a broken DVD player that I pulled the uh, gears out of the tray for and and these little shafts came out of uh, the focus adjustment for a camera and then we got this little little bushing here that goes on there you definitely throw some grease on the shaft and this is actually a pretty high friction point um, I would rather used a metal this a metal piece for this hex part, but it just wasn't in the bag, so it actually does surprisingly well. The as far as not melting together, and this stuff is rotating at a fairly decent speed. So, all right, so everything is lubed up. I'll go ahead and tighten down these screws. All right, there's the transmission all assembled. And we'll go ahead and install it and show you how it works. All right, the transmission's all installed. I'm gonna show you uh, how close everything really is. It's pretty tight in there. Um, but that servo is controlled by a little Arduino board. Um, it's a uh, microcontroller that you can make your own code and whatnot for. Uh, what I did was just made a really tight compact package with a um, 2.4 gigahertz uh, transceiver. So I wired that all up to work with this system and then I made a little pigtail uh, to run 5 volts to the board and then this goes to the servo. Alright, I'm going to touch on what I did with the transmitter real quick. Um, to make the Arduino work with it. Um, what I did was I took a Arduino Nano um, and the board I had laying around for it and just cut out this section here and then 
um, just hot glued it in here to hold it in place. Here's the switch that I'll actually use for shifting. Oop. All right. So there's the Arduino, and then it's all wired up, and it has these pins on it, so you can actually uh, plug in whatever you want. I have the first two analog pins wired into the um, stock locations for the pots. Uh, so this would be the throttle, and then you have your steering pot right here. So I wired those both in so that the Arduino is reading both of those signals, and I can create basically a fully functional um, Arduino controller with, with speed control and whatnot um, if you were to do that. So there's the transmitter as well, the little, uh, or the transceiver, the 2.4 gigahertz transceiver. That's that. I have it all wired up so it turns on with, just with the normal transmitter function so you don't have to do anything special. And we'll turn this thing on. I also made a uh, couple battery holders and put these lithium ion batteries in there. I got for really cheap, so we'll turn this guy on. All right, next I'll show you how it works. Um, go ahead and adjust the speed so it goes by itself. Okay. So if you can see the little shift linkage and the servo acting in there, super low creeper gear. And we'll test it on the ground. You got your high speed right here, and then you got your low gear here. What I really made the low gear for was to, uh, for the more technical little crawling parts. This is at all no problem for this, but. Yeah. And there you have it.